Hey YouTube, it's Sarah Lyon and I'm back with another video and today I will be doing a part two to my part one girls talk. It is currently 1.51 in the morning and I have nothing to do so this will be like a late night girls talk. So if you don't know what the girls talk is, you can tune into my video I posted like three weeks ago and it explains what a girl talk is and everything. So let's just get into the video and make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Circulated bitch. Okay, so first topic I got is how to have a good character because whew, these bees is aggravating. Okay, how to keep up with your good character is kill them with kindness. Kill them with kindness. Most females who don't like you, low key, they are obsessed with you. I feel like every female that don't like me, you obsessed with me because what did I do for you not to like me? So kill them with kindness. Just kill them with straight kindness. You don't have to go on social media talking about them or do anything in that. Kill them with kindness. Kill them with kindness. So the next topic is mm. <laughs> somebody said how to fix a leave out. I'm struggling. So me personally, I don't get leave outs no more because for one, leave out leave outs damage your hair. They really do damage your hair. But with laces and frontals, they take out your edges. So what I do, I found somebody who really does my hair and like my edges, everything stays like 100% stays, my edges come out, anything. So I'm sticking to my frontals and my bundles or whatever I get. But how to fix a leave out? What I would do is don't always put heat on it. Like try putting some spritz or something or don't always put heat on it because putting heat on it is gonna make it look crunchy and dry no no it's not gonna look good anymore like no okay another question if you was ever if you was to ever say you was gay how do you think your parents would feel i don't know i i never i never liked the girl so I don't know. I don't know how they would feel. I'm like, they'll be supportive. I have supportive parents, so. They won't, like, no, they won't do the most. They probably won't accept it at first, but they will have to accept it eventually. Um, somebody asks how to get a job easily. Honestly, I don't know. My first job I worked at was at Hungry House, and I hated that job. Well, I ain't gonna lie. My first month until I was making a little bread, I was like, okay, I like this job. But now, I've been quit though, y'all. I quit like within three months. I couldn't take it no more, no. But how I got a job was, <sighs> how did I get that job again? Oh, I knew somebody. It's always to go, it's always, it's always good to go get a job when you know somebody at because they could just talk to the people and be like, oh, da, 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 she's a good person. Da, da, da. So I feel like getting a, a good job, you have to know somebody who works there and get you put in. Okay. Another question is hygiene. Hygiene is very important, especially to a girl because girls have odors and girls have everything. Like, well, everybody have odors, but yeah. Make sure you always clean up with yourself. Me personally, I use Dove, Dove, everything. My skin breaks out from ivory screen or anything other than, I can't use nothing but Dove. Dove bar, Dove liquid, Dove everything. Like everything gotta be Dove. When I take showers, it's straight Dove. I cannot have nothing else but Dove. So get into the Dove. Um, Relationship advice. This is a big one. Everybody always asks me for relationship advice. <laughs> Y'all, I be getting relationship advice and I don't even take my own advice. <laughs> my boyfriend say it all the time. You never take your own advice and <laughs> it's terrible. Okay, so rule number one. I'm gonna give y'all three relationship tips. Three. Um, one, 
Don't ever think your boyfriend homeboy is your friend. You will get messed up big time. You would, the boyfriend, friends, is friends of everybody, okay? Period. There is no favorite. Don't ever think it's a favorite. Don't ever think you're the favorite. No. No, 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 no. They don't owe you no loyalty at all. They owe him all the loyalty. So don't ever get close with the homeboy because the homeboy is not your friend. Second advice. Um. Hmm. I don't know. Um. Don't take all your problems to social media. Say God got into it. Don't go on Instagram. Oh, I'm single. Da da da. No. Because all you're getting, do all you're doing is making yourself look dumb. People are gonna clown you. People are gonna you know. So don't do that. Tip three. Never, ever, 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 ever go to outsiders for advice. Outsiders will always mess up your head. Always go with your own, like, what you feel. It's okay to get tips from people, like, how should I move? How? Don't ever get, like, don't ever go to outsiders, because nine times out of ten, what you told that person, they told the next person. And that person said the next person, and the next person, and the next person. So, no. It's better off just to keep your stuff to yourself. And that's the three main relationship tips I got for y'all. Um, I got another question. How to move on? Me personally, my first heartbreak, oh my gosh. I was so heartbroken. I was in the ninth grade and it was just depressing. How did I get over that? It took me so long. Like, I don't even remember how I got over it. I was so hurt and I didn't want to like tell anybody because it was like, I thought he was the one and it was just like, no, like I really got heartbroken for it. So my first heartbroken, it took me a long time to get over it. But not, not necessarily. I wasn't like not eating or losing weight. No, 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 no. I just started focusing on myself. I was, so I just started getting into stuff started getting into cheerleading I was doing stuff so how to move on is get, do something you like start doing focus on other things outside of relationship because you don't need a boy I started doing other stuff and I think that's how I got over it like over a the time it's just you're not gonna be stuck on somebody forever like you're just not gonna be stuck on somebody forever that's just not gonna happen um another question Dating friends ex. That's something you do not do. You do not do that. I don't care if you, I don't care if your friend was dating him for three days. Do not do that. I don't care if you ask her and be like, do you think it's okay if I talk to him? No, 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 no. You do not date your friend's ex. That's the girl code that you do not break. You cannot talk to your friend's ex. That's not okay. And if you feel like that's okay, you got a problem. <laughs> you have a honest, you have a honestly big problem because you can't do that. I cannot even like be buddy buddy with my friend, ex boyfriend. Like no, like I can't do that. No. Um. Another question is how to get more people to interact with your business. Um. I don't know. I always been like I always had a little fame. I'm not gonna say I'm famous, but I always had a little fame. So I don't know. People always support me. But I can say is get more out there. Like get promos from people. Don't be scared to be like, oh, she finna think, she, oh, she don't be bougie. Get promos, like really do promos. Promos really help because if somebody see, they're, if they're promoting you, you will get people on your page. People will look at you, you get more insights, you get everything. So I think promos really do work. I do promos too. So if you have any promos, you can do me. Um. Weight issues. Like I said in my last video, everybody is beautiful. You can be big, you can be small. Weight issues is like, well, I said weight issues. I meant like weight issues. You should never have weight issues. I know some people really be like, dang, I'm too big, dang, I'm too small. No, embrace your beauty. You should always embrace your beauty. At any given moment, embrace your beauty. Embrace that beauty, girl. Embrace it. Self-esteem. Look in the mirror every day. No. 
if you have self-esteem check this too get a mirror and put like your sticky notes and put i'm pretty i'm beautiful i can do this i'm powerful i'm <laughs> i'm a boss i'm just like a whole bunch of positive things and look in that mirror every single day and read every single last one of them quotes and notes you get some more life i promise you um topic on feeling alone me sometimes personally i really do sometimes i really do feel alone like i feel like i'm against the world or i feel like nobody's here i can't talk to nobody i do have those moments but that is very bad that is very bad that is really bad i even took a counselor for it it is really bad you should never get into a dark place because when you get into a dark place it make you do dark things so i advise you to get a counselor or get somebody like you're close to and talk to them like never feel like you're alone because it can get you into a really really dark place and another topic haters at all my haters i'm only gonna see this but i don't care at every single last one of my haters because i don't care about you like you build me all my haters if you have haters you pop them i know that's so like 2015 but if you ain't got haters you ain't popping so if you got haters you popping sis so people gonna hate regardless anything you do people is gonna hate you for anything you do you can walk around with a pink shirt they gonna hate you anything you can do somebody's gonna hate on you so haters like can't put it on no better just it's like an easy one sorry it is just gonna hate <laughs> never be a hater though that's not good you should not be a hater the phone won't let me log in oh, okay um another question staying motivated in school mm, i'm not really like a school girl but I get my work done, if it doesn't make any sense. Um, I don't really like care for like, you know, like I'm going home to study, no. <laughs> Never been that type of person, no. <laughs> but I get my work done. Just think, in the future, where you wanna be? So think about, anytime you're doing like a test or feel like you're ready to give up, think about your future because your future is like everything. Um, another question is not losing yourself in a, in a relationship. Me. don't put the boy first love yourself more than you love him because you will lose yourself you will feel like i'm not i can't do this or i'm not pretty enough or no you will lose yourself in the long run because when y'all break up you will feel like you have nothing and nobody and do not lose yourself that's number one rule do not lose yourself um Niggas who act like they don't care. <laughs> put in that I don't care attitude too. If you like him and he act like he don't care, put in that I don't care attitude too. Chris, Chris, y'all, Chris is very nonchalant. But I tell this by himself, like, boy, no. If you don't fix it or you don't do this, put your foot down. Let them know what it is. So that is the end of my girl talk part two. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, like I said before. And if you want another girl's talk and you want to ask me more questions, feel free to DM me and I will have a part three.